if you're viewing this, this video is not clickbait. But, um, Hazel really did leave me. You asked me about a whiny, I guess I'm a bag for me. Your body looks better on me, cause they get sweating for me. Won't you back for me? Won't you back? Won't you back? Watch me back for you. What is up gang what it do what it do but um as you can see right now i am sitting here alone the past few days has been a little boring it's been a little weird i just been chilling you know what i mean like i just been chilling i know y'all haven't been seeing like a lot of frequent uploads and it is due to the fact that hazel is gone she has been gone for a week now it's been a whole week um if you all haven't been keeping up with us okay so let me just let me just explain exactly what this video is really about and this video is really just me ranting you know what i mean like i'm gonna just talk to y'all um i've just been bored i've been lonely um as y'all as y'all know if y'all follow my instagram and keep up with me personally. Y'all know my homie, um, Dom. He moved back to Atlanta, so we just been vibing. We been chilling. Yesterday was his birthday, you know what I mean? So, um, we went to the movies and shit like that. But other than that, like, I just been here bored. And if y'all want me to do a video showing, like, what I do all day now that Hazel isn't here, you know what I mean? Like, I would be more than happy to do that. I would do that today if y'all want. I don't do anything for for like I just be I just be vibing. I just kind of been bored, just been in my own mind. Um, I haven't been working on YouTube. Ain't really been doing much, you know what I mean? But um, like I said before, as y'all know, me and um. What was I talking about? I don't even remember what I was talking about, bro. Oh yeah, as I was mentioning before, if y'all if y'all been following me and Hazel for a while now, y'all know where we came from, how we started. Y'all know our background. Y'all know exactly what happened. You know what I mean? Like what lit the match of Milo and Hazel. Y'all know that. We explained it plenty of times. We um mentioned it in many videos, but I'm gonna mention it again. So me and Hazel. It's literally like a love story, bro. Like, it's it's like that ultimate love story, bro. And I know a lot of YouTube couples, you know what I mean? Like, there's, you got YouTube couples that, that can relate. I don't think any of them can really relate on a level that is necessary to actually understand our bond and our chemistry. So me and Hazel, we met on Snapchat, bro. Like, we met on Snapchat. Like I said, if y'all keep up with me personally, Y'all know, two years ago, two years, literally yesterday, two years ago, November 28th, me and my homie Dom, we did this video, and the video blew up, it went viral. That's what really jump-started my career, that's what really jump-started his career, um, but, so as y'all know with that, it was a video, it was, it was a 10 toes down challenge, um, so, that video, let me remind you. Hazel didn't have Instagram. She didn't have Facebook. You know what I mean? She didn't get on YouTube for real, for real. Um, all she had was Snapchat. She didn't have Twitter. So, <clears throat> one day, her little sister, her little sister was watching a video and showed her the video like, oh, look at them. They're, they're good, right? You know what I mean? Like, I think they're really good. Do you? Blah, blah, blah. So, you know that typical stuff. And her, she was like, Oh, he's cute. You know what I mean? She added me on Snapchat, but she's never Snapchatted me. She even told me that she didn't even really watch my stories, you know what I mean? Because she never really got on Snapchat. She added me on Snapchat six months prior. Six months before. Yeah, six months prior to her DMing me you know, or Snapchatting me. And 
my Snapchat, I used it, I was getting like 60,000 viewers at the time. So it's not like I was seeing all of my Snapchats. Like literally every 30 seconds, a new Snapchat was coming in. So for me to open your Snapchat, it was very rare. <laughs> Because I wasn't the type of dude to sit there and open all my all my messages. I'm sorry, but I just didn't have the time for that. So, it was one day. I posted something on my story that day. It was really just a promotion ta tactic. Like, I was just trying to promote my other Instagram account. So, I posted on Snapchat. And I was like, for everyone who follows my, my new Instagram, you know what I mean? Like, I will post you on my Snapchat. All you have to do is send me a picture. Whatever picture you want to post it and already like type all of your social media information on. So I did like two of them and then I opened her Snapchat. You know what I mean? I just happened to open her Snapchat. Oh my, you know what I mean? Like that's all I said, like oh my, like literally she was just unbelievably beautiful to me, bro. Like it was, it was crazy. Like I, I was, I was just like, bro, like this, she has to be a catfish, bro. Like no, like she has to be a catfish, you feel me? I eventually asked her, I was like, if I give you my number, will you use it? And she was like, maybe, you know what I mean? Playing hard to get. And that night she didn't text me. Like she didn't text me at all. So, I mean, I wasn't, I wasn't thirsty or nothing. I wasn't feeling, I wasn't feeling some type of way. You feel me? But I was just like, okay, you know, I didn't expect much anyways. You know what I mean? Like around that time, around that time, I was going through a lot. Like we just put that on the table. I was going through a lot at that time. I was in a very dark, dark place. And me personally, I wasn't looking for a relationship. I wasn't looking for a bond. I wasn't looking for a connection with anybody. I was just trying to find myself at the time. So I didn't think nothing, I didn't think nothing of it. Like I had no intentions on getting at her. I just, I just wanted conversation for her. Like I said, I was in a dark place and I, I honestly felt like I needed a friend at that time, bro. <laughs> she didn't hit me up, just, just like that, bro. The next day, there was this girl I knew. She sent all laughing emojis, you know what I mean? Like, I posted like eight people that night. So it was weird to me that she only sent laughing emojis to her picture. I asked her, where are you from? She told me she was from Chicago. The girl I knew lived in Wisconsin, that's right by Chicago. She lived an hour away from Chicago. So I'm like, she must know her or something. So I asked her, I sent her a picture of the girl. I was like, do you know her? She was like, no, but she's super pretty though. It was just weird that she sent laughing emojis only to your post, blah, blah, blah. So we was just talking on Snapchat um, for that minute. She looks at it like, okay, you find an excuse to message me again. You know what I mean? She always says that to me. But um, in my mind, I was really like, I was really curious, but I guess, I guess that gave me a reason to to message her again, you know what I mean? So I like fed into it. I, I actually took the bait. And I took my chances, I don't care, shit, mm, shit, it is what it is, you feel me? And then eventually she was like, what's your number again? I'm gonna text you because she forgot to save it in a Snapchat thread. I gave her my number, she started texting me, and... You heard that? It was in the attic, bro. And we started texting. Still, at this moment, I think she's a catfish, bro. Now, this just like validated. Yeah, she's a catfish for sure. When I asked her, do you have an Instagram? No. Twitter? No. Facebook? No. All I have is Snapchat. <laughs> you feel me? Over with. Like, at that point, I was like, over with. You know what I mean? But I didn't press it too much. I just, I just kept it to myself just so I just wanted to find out. Now, if I ask you if you're on a FaceTime and you tell me, no. Hey, my phone, my phone died. Like, yeah, you, you, you dubbed just like that. That's that's where my head was at. But I played it cool. I kept conversation, and I asked. I was like, I was like, can you send me a few more pictures of you just to see if the pictures would add up? And surprisingly, they did. She sent me a a bunch of them, and then she asked me if I could send her some pictures. She was just so bad to me, bro. Like, she was just so beautiful to me. I was like, at night, we was just texting. It was day two or day three. We talked on the phone, you know what I mean? And it was, I don't know, it was just something about her, bro. Like, I couldn't even put my finger on it. It was just something about her. She was so intelligent. She was so wise. She was so smart. I think it was, I think it was like day five when we faced time. And that was, it was raps. It was raps, like, You feel me? It was a rap, bro. So I told her, I was like, I'm gonna make you mine. And she she like laughed at me, you know what I mean? Cause I live in Georgia, you live in Chicago, bro. And she's never had a boyfriend. 
So she was, it shook her up a little bit, you know what I mean? And I told her, I was like, I promise you, I promise you, I made her mine. Like, ain't no time, ain't no reason to wait, you know what I mean? Like, ain't no reason to wait. Like, you showed me enough, just like two weeks, three weeks into us talking, like, I felt like I knew her, you know what I mean? So, why wait? Simple as that, why wait? The first three months was just long distance. Her birthday is coming up. I just popped up in Chicago. I just popped up and surprised her. That's like where everything jump started. Before that, it was like, yeah, we were together, but she didn't have 100% faith that we was gonna last because we were long distance. I refuse to let, let us fail. Everything just went up from there. Like We were just a long distance relationship. She used to come see me like every month, every two months, shit like that. And then finally, 10 months into our relationship, like I asked her to move in with me. You know, at first she didn't know. She wasn't exactly sure if we were ready for that. We were with each other every single day. Every single day, the only time, yeah, ever since she moved in, we was with each other every single day. If I traveled, she traveled with me, boop, 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 every single day. And I just never wanted to make this video. She's been gone a whole week, but I miss her. She left me. She went to Chicago for a week. And I've been sad. I've been lonely. Oh, y'all thought I was talking about she broke up? Oh, y'all tripping, bro. Nah, nah, she, nah, she, she crazy. Nah, she, if she thinks she finna break up with me, she crazy, bruh. She don't know me. But she never met my love, you fool me. Nah, she ain't, nah. Y'all tripping, bruh. What, what the heck? Y'all bugging, bruh. Y'all tripping. I can't believe y'all actually, why would y'all, nah, like, why, what are you talking about? Why, why you think that, though? I feel bad for the people that's actually having a conversation with me right now, actually answering back, bro. <laughs> but no, she, she just, she just went to Chicago for, or she didn't even go to Chicago. She just stayed in Chicago, you know what I mean? So technically, I left her and came back home while she stayed in Chicago, cause you know she had to get her ID and everything. I know we said in the last video she wasn't staying, but things changed. You feel me? She decided it was better if she just stay there, just go ahead and take care of everything, and then come back. So. She'll be back, she'll be back in a few days, but I still miss her, bro. So I just got tomorrow. I gotta get through tomorrow, that's all. It's already been a week. I know y'all probably like, boy, you suck. It's a, it's, boy, you only gotta wait one day and you over here crying now. It's already been a week, bro. It's the longest we went without each other. Like, I know it sounds crazy, but I've been walking around the house calling everybody baby. <laughs> I'm just so used to only talking to her. I was, I was like, I called Dom baby like three times. Like, he, like, we was watching a prank video. He said something. I was like, nah, baby, it's bro. I meant bro. I said bro. You hearing things, bro. I ain't, I ain't call you baby. You feel me? So, y'all bugging, though. I don't know why y'all would think that. You know what I mean? Like, I didn't say she broke up. I just said she left me. In which I kind of left her. But, nah, y'all bugging. I don't know why y'all think that. Y'all know. Y'all know Hayes ain't going nowhere. I ain't going, I ain't going. I just did this video just for fun, you know what I mean? Like, I, just, I really wanted to prank y'all. But can I ask everybody for a favor? I know there's gonna be some trolls in here that don't care about the favor I ask, but can I ask y'all, just do not go in the comments and comment, it was a prank. Um, Because you know what I mean? Like, I know some of y'all be like, y'all just wanna feel, feel like, oh, I called it out, I'm about to help everybody so they don't fall for it, you know what I mean? But, you know, I'm just, I'm just doing this just for, humorous purposes so don't 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 be don't be that person bro don't be that person who just ruin everything like just let it play out just let everybody else watch the video and have a nice laugh you know what i mean like that's that's the whole purpose of this video so every single comment i see that's talking about it's a prank blah 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 i'm deleting it like if if anything like if any here she go right here what are you doing? I'm recording a video. For our channel? Mm-hmm. What video? The She Left Me prank. What? What? The, it's like, I'm telling them you left me. Why? Look how ugly I look. You look beautiful. Don't she look beautiful, yo? No. <laughs> you ready to come home? You're not ugly, shut up. You look cute. 
Thank you, baby. But all right, y'all, if I got you, just comment in the section, be like, oh my God, I can't believe this. You know what I mean? Don't don't say, oh, it's a prank. Don't spoil get... it for everybody. Yeah, don't spoil it for everybody. Like, I'm just trying to get a good laugh out of people. So, um, you want to do the outro with me, baby? <laughs> Look at her. She's so cute. <laughs> But yeah, if you enjoyed this video, give this video a thumbs up, bro. If you're new to this channel, subscribe to this channel. And don't forget to turn on that notification bell. Thanks, you for me. As always, as always, as always, as always, as always. May God bless us all, yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, that was kind of lit. <laughs> I love you. You ask me a better one, I guess I'm a bag for me. Your body looks better on me, cause they get sweating for me. Won't you beg for me? Won't you beg? Won't you beg? Watch me beg for you.